She's moved past the Hunger Games and carved her own identity in the strange world of Hollywood. Here's what Willow Shields has been up to since that franchise wrapped. When the Hunger Games premiered in 2012, it launched the careers of a whole new generation of young actors. Stars like Jennifer Lawrence, Liam Hemsworth, and Josh Hutcherson have all gone on to lead their own films or film franchises, while others have enjoyed steady work in movies and TV. Willow Shields, who played Katniss Everdeen's little sister Primrose, was cast in the role when she was just 11. Although it wasn't her first acting role, it definitely put her career on a different trajectory. May the odds be ever in your favor. Getting cast in the Hunger Games franchise got Shields' career off to a strong start, as it meant a major role in not one, but four different films, ending with The Hunger Games Mockingjay Part 2 in 2015. By the time filming wrapped, Shields had spent a third of her young life portraying Prim, and it was difficult to say goodbye. Shields told Teen Vogue in 2015, There was some sadness to filming the final two films. On my last day, Jennifer Lawrence came in my trailer and gave me a sweet gift, and we just hung out for a little while. It was hard because it was my last day on set and my last shot as Prim. It was all very emotional. But luckily for Shields, her career didn't die with her character. After Mockingjay Part 2, Willow Shields followed up on that success by becoming the youngest contestant on Dancing with the Stars, joining the show's 20th season in 2015. Before the 14-year-old landed the gig, the previous record holder had been a 16-year-old Zendaya. As a relative newcomer to dancing, learning and performing a new routine each week was a challenge, especially because child labor laws mandated that she take at least one day off per week. As she told Teen Vogue, her prior role as Prim added even more pressure to her Dancing with the Stars appearances, because, as she said, she knew millions of young girls looked up to her. On top of that, Shields sustained multiple injuries, including a dislocated rib. Despite all these difficulties, Shields and her dancing partner were one of the highest scoring duos during season 20, but her good fortune ended in week 7, when her ninja-themed dance routine didn't impress fans enough to keep her around another week. Sadly, the odds were no longer in her favor, but it seems like she doesn't regret it. I can't even describe how amazing it's been. It's been an experience of a lifetime. Shields has had multiple roles in movies and TV since The Hunger Games wrapped up. Her first post-prim role was also her first lead role in a feature film, when she was cast as Rachel in 2017's Into the Rainbow, a Chinese-New Zealand joint production about two girls who were magically transported to China via a magic rainbow. The next year, she landed her first co-lead in an American feature with the role of Lorraine in Woodstocker Bust, a coming-of-age road flick about two teens traveling to the legendary 1965 rock concert. Shields has also delved into television work, with a supporting role in the 2019 horror series The Unsettling, about a 16-year-old foster child whose new home isn't all that it seems. The Unsettling lasted for one season, and in 2020, Shields had another supporting role as Serena Baker, the younger sister of main character Cat Baker, in the Netflix skating series Spinning Out. It was also canceled after one season. Her next feature role was a lead part in the 2022 coming-of-age indie drama When Time Got Louder. While she was supposed to star alongside Tim Roth and Vincent D'Onofrio in the crime thriller A Fall from Grace from director Jennifer Lynch, the film, first announced in 2012, has not gone into production to date. Anyone who looks at Willow Shield's social media can see that she keeps herself active and out in nature. Part of that comes from her dedication to climbing. Shields created a section of her Instagram called Climbing, where she posts reels of her climbing up indoor rock walls, training for climbs by doing pull-ups, and the effect on her hands as a result of the exercise. After more than a year, she eventually progressed to climbing real rocky terrain outdoors, and continually updates the Instagram section as she gains more climbing experience. In one Instagram post, Shields wrote, Rock climbing really brings out the badass and happiness in me. If Willow Shields isn't posting about climbing or her passion for photography, she is definitely posting an image of the latest book she's reading. As with climbing, Shields has a section of her Instagram dedicated to reading, where she posts particular quotes, chapters, and books that she is reading. Most of her books she finds in thrift stores, which she also showcases on her Instagram. She often makes individual posts about reading on her Instagram, but most of her individual reading posts are showcased through her second Instagram account, Willow Shelf, where she shares the cover of the book, the title, the author, the page count, and a quick review in her caption. Shields clearly feels comfortable sharing personal details on her social media, but that went a step further when in 2022, Shields came out via Instagram. In June, the actress posted a picture of herself with the caption, Hi, I'm Bi, happy pride. She also revealed that she has a girlfriend. In September 2023, Shields posted a few photos of them together, with a caption, Reminder to kiss your girlfriend and the pride flag next to it. One friend wrote in response, Y'all are glowing with happiness and I love it. Though Shields does not tag her girlfriend in the post, likely for privacy reasons, the two are publicly together. 
Though Willow Shields has an obvious love for climbing, she also loves adventuring in the great outdoors. She is constantly posting photos of herself hiking through mountains, spending time in the forest, and traveling to all sorts of places out of town. She captures most of these adventures on a vintage film camera. So I shot it all on film, and then I developed the film in my apartment. So, you know, I use all the chemicals and develop it. In one post, Shields documented a trip to Yosemite with one of her friends, showing off the mountains, the hikes she went on, painting in the woods, and eating ice cream with a great view. In another post, Shields showed off her trip to Alaska. In another post, she and her twin Autumn can be seen in the snow at Rocky Mountain National Park in Colorado. And in yet another, Shields shared photos of herself exploring Utah. When she's not acting, Shields finds time to pursue other creative projects and enjoy the perks of fame. Aside from being an avid photographer, climber, and bookworm, she's also a budding fashionista. She first got a taste for fashion while making appearances during the many Hunger Games press tours and film premieres, wearing gowns and outfits designed by some of the world's top designers. However, her fashion pursuits didn't stop there. Since then, Shields has been a regular fixture at New York Fashion Week, following in the footsteps of co-star Jennifer Lawrence. In 2016, she was the youngest front row New York Fashion Week attendee. She also worked with Law Roach, an American stylist known for his work with young celebrities such as Zendaya and Anya Taylor-Joy. When The Hollywood Reporter caught up with her during NYFW in 2016, Shields described her personal style, saying, It's kind of a mix of things. A lot of it is vintage. I always have loved wearing vintage clothing. I would definitely say kind of vintage, grunge, but also sometimes a very chic, classic look is something that I like to throw in. Willow Shields has long been active in charity work, too. She's worked in particular to end bullying in its many forms, and is an advocate for people to live their lives how they please. In 2011, she designed a t-shirt for Blue Shirt Day, an anti-bullying event organized by Stomp Out Bullying. She's also an advocate for Delete Digital Drama, an anti-cyberbullying nonprofit. Her advocacy for anti-bullying is also likely self-motivated, as she was under a lot of pressure and criticism to play prim a certain way and received her fair share of internet bullying. In addition to anti-bullying activism, Shields advocates for Operation Smile, a nonprofit that helps children born with cleft palates. She also works with The Thirst Project, an initiative bringing clean drinking water to impoverished children. She's aided efforts to help victims of natural disasters, provide food for impoverished or homeless families, mitigate the effects of climate change on forests, and promote awareness of gun violence and mass school shootings. Though Willow Shields is an avid social media user herself, she can understand firsthand the dangers and mental damage using social media can have. In an effort to demystify the allure of social media and show solidarity with those who struggle with its expectations, Shields created a photo series and written letter in 2017 for a project called Dear Social Media, which featured diverse women sharing their thoughts on the various pressures and dangers of the internet. As she told KTLA, I've shot a series of photos that I've kind of titled Women Warriors, and a lot of it is about just celebrating the beauty and diversity of all women. The project premiered at BeautyCon LA in 2017, with a feminist photography featuring model Iskra Lawrence and actor Tracy Ellis Ross. Though this was an outlet of creativity for Shields, and also matches her activist pursuits, including Shields' involvement in the March for Our Lives and the Women's March. In talking with Teen Vogue about the project, Shields said, it's really important that we make light of the issues women face on social media, not just by recognizing it, but by transforming it into an important, interesting issue. My goal is to do this through art.